Hi, welcome to the Java programming tutorial. Um, last um, tutorial we looked at um, mouse listener and so we could click and do different things with the mouse. What we're going to look at today is mouse motion listener and we're going to use it for drag and drop. And so what we're going to do is we're going to implement the mouse motion listener just the same way as we did for mouse listener. Right, this is the main program. You can see that we added to the main program um, add mouse motion listener and the class it was in. I'm going to mouse listener. I'm going to comment this out because we're not going to use going to use mouse motion listener, but you can use both at the same time. And so what I'm going to do here is implement mouse motion listener. Yes, most be at the beginning. Now, what we need to do is import the path and the two methods that come with it. So I'm just going to do this quickly and assume that you know you've seen this done before. So the two methods for most motion listener will appear at the bottom. Now, we've got a white square and it's got an X coordinate and a Y coordinate and uh, we've used a variable called x1 and y1 so we're going to use these in the drag and mouse drag and so so and what we're going to do x1 equals e this e here e dot get x method and so that's going to um, this is going to get the x position of the mouse pointer and it's going to equal that to x1 but we don't want that the mouse um, the square to be drawn um, from this coordinate because that's the top left hand corner and so we want it in the center and so the way we would do that is by minus 50 and so we're just going to do the x coordinate first so you can see it working. And the next step is we need to add the same as this here, but we need to add this dot add mouse motion. If we say press run the program, okay, run it again, and what should happen is we can just move the square and the x coordinates um, with the 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 mouse. So if I click here, it should jump. The square should jump into the center when we move it. So we'll change the code so that doesn't happen. Now we're going to do the 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 y coordinates. So no, but it's just the same code. Well, obviously it's it's y one. It's y one, and it's get y. And minus fifty again. So if I save the program, done, and now we can move it up and down anywhere we want because we've got x and y, and notice the square square sh it's in the center for x but it's not in the sector center for, for y we'll look at that later right okay right so that's us able to to move it about right and so so i'm going to stop now and we're going to do another tutorial on it um so that's that's how we implement right mouse motion listener and we use it for drag and drop we're going to drop it in a certain area and if it doesn't drop in that area it will jump back to where it came from so again thank you for your time I hope that's been 
of some use to you and um, I hope that you can hear the video because I've got myself a, a pop filter and so let me know if you can if you, you can hear it okay thank you